やっぱり酒は命の水だな。これで話をしやすくなったな。ああ。おお、とも。ああ。おかげで口も滑らかよ。大丈夫なんだろうな。いや。大丈夫、大丈夫。つっても俺らが知ってることなんて大したことないと思
Oh, did you break past my defenses? Oh, uh, what was that about second-rate hitmen getting taken out by their targets? You met your match today, so don't come back. Uh, I won't. Imagine how many lives Kiryu is changing all across this city. Because they're like, yeah, I'm hot shit. They fight the main character, and they're like, I'm not hot shit. And they're like, no. Go out and get a life. Uh, okay, I'll do that. <laughs> You're getting stronger every day, boy. Uh. Yeah, guess I have you to thank for that. No, no, no. We have to thank uh, this weird-ass mechanic where we eat money and get stronger, Kiryu. The world is bent around uh, your uh, your whims. Oh, here we go. Alright, bring it. Oi, so gonna anta. Nanjinikita. この辺で筋門に飲ませる店はないよ。立花不動産の人間がここに出入りしているって聞いてきたんだが、今もいるか。ああ。あんた。また登場会の若い衆か。よく言うな。だったら立花不動産に何の用だ。あの連中のことを知
Yeah, yeah, yeah. He wants to control the narrative. He doesn't want it to be through his underlings, yeah. ここの人たちはヤクザが嫌いと。うん。そういや。あんたらがヤクザからチャンピオンが守ってるってのは本当か。うん。ま、一応ね。社長の方針があるからさ。All right, Oh, champion district. Oh, I got you. Damn. Yeah. Oh, this is pretty serious. Oh, <laughs>あそこの連中は所詮流れ者の寄せ集めだ。あんたもスナック生瀬の店長を見たろ。さも肩木の被害者ですって面してたがよ。あいつらだって夜空流れてきた時、元いた住人を追い出してんだから。因果応報ってやつだよ。Oh, Taitano Oh my god, what is happening here? Um Oh my. Boom. Double prizes. What is going on here? Yes. What is this? <sighs> Punish me. Hmm? Hmm? Hurry. Now. Punish me where everyone can see my shame. Oh. Some kind of SM club is here, I guess. Man, what people do in the privacy of their own homes is one thing, but is this really necessary out on the street? Um, okay then? You, you middle aged man! Yes! Go on! Um, um, you lusty guy! More! Put your soul into it! Please visit again, you, you, customer! No, 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 Ayu-chan, that was no good. Like, nothing about it was working, nothing at all. I knew you were bad during the role play, but I didn't expect you to be bad at just saying goodbye. C can you please tell me what I did wrong? Where do I start? When I asked you to punish me, you said I was a middle-aged man. That's the truth, not a put-down. I suppose that's true. And then you called me lusty. I mean, who says that? If I'm coming here, lust is pretty obvious, I think. What's the joy in being told what you already know? Also true. <sighs> and to top it off, please visit again? That's proper business etiquette, not sadomasochism. I'm so sorry. Oh man, Ayu-chan, you're an SNM queen. A dominatrix. You should never, ever apologize. Other than your terrible humiliation skills, you're the girl of my dreams. But I don't know if I can keep this up. If you disappoint me next time, I'll have to ask for a different girl. See ya. Wow. <laughs> oh, she's crying. SNM must be a tough act. She's crying. Do I console her? Yep. Yes, so. Oi. Hey. Are you okay? Oh. Uh. Sorry. I'm sorry for causing a scene in public too. Yeah. Uh, it's okay. Well, it was a scene, uh, I guess. But this S and M thing, it sure has some unique challenges, doesn't it? 
Yes, very much so. What do you think after watching that? I'm not cut out for this line of work, am I? Hmm. Hmm. Honestly, you do seem to be too caring and gentle to play a dominatrix. I find it very hard to berate someone, especially a client. It just feels like I'm being rude. Hmm. I would think your customers pay you because they want you they want to be abused by you. If you're so hung up about berating someone, why are you even working as a dominatrix? Since I was a child, I could never rebuke anyone. Even my, when my friends betrayed me, I laughed it off and forgave them. I'm still like that today. But those relationships I built on swallowing my feelings were false. They were shallow. I realized I had no real friends. Not one person with whom I could share my honest feelings. My man Kiryu just coming up to be like, Hey, why'd you decide to be a dominatrix? And then they're like, When I was five years old, I had Cheerios for the first time. They were honey nut. My life was changed forever. And since then, I wanted to make guys nut. <laughs> You know, like, it's it's just, wait, what? Uh, uh, okay, go on, yeah, mm hmm <laughs> Kiryu needs to establish the Saitama policy of 20 words. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It's like, uh, okay. Uh, this is a lot. Um, okay. Uh, <laughs> he's immediately like, uh, this is a bit much. Um, okay. I took this job to transform myself into someone who can tell people exactly what's on her mind. But now I see that I'm not cut out for it. Well, that's quite a leap of logic to make. <laughs> yes, thank you. <laughs> but if you're still motivated, why not stick with it? But, but, I, I don't have the talent to be a dominatrix. Hey, check it out. Got ourselves a real life dominatrix. Oh no, it's chauvinist swine. One and two. <laughs> hey, baby, you always dress like that. Oh, I beg of you, please make me your slave. Ha 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 ha. Uh, um, I'm sorry, could you? Uh huh? Eh? Uh, what was that? You got something to say, kinky lady? Um, no, I'm sorry. Oh! <laughs> what the hell is this? I thought you were supposed to be all royal and shit. Some SM queen you are. She says you're bad for business. Uh huh? Eh? Uh, I'll say it for her. Don't loiter in front of the club. You're bad for business. Huh? Stay out of this, you squealing pig. You can't act all tough when you're trotting out of an S&M dungeon. I'm not a customer. Just get lost. You're a nuisance. Don't order me around, bacon boy. Widow masochist piggy wubs are taking a punch, am I right? I know how to make you feel real good then. Why do they like, like, isn't Kiryu 6'6 six, six and like 200 pounds? And they just did that like it was nothing. Dead. All right, go squealing. Go. Ow, damn, this masochist is tough. You're supposed to like getting your ass spanked. Huh? I said I'm not a customer. Do I need to pound that into your skull again? Ah! <laughs> Next time, pick a safe word before you ask for a flogging. If I see you around here again, you're dead meat. Ah! Sorry! Um, excuse me? Sorry, I caused a big scene fighting in front of your, uh, club. No, no, that's okay. Thank you for telling those men what I wanted to say myself. And, um... What is it? Could you... Yes. 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 Mm-hmm. Could you teach me how to punish people? Nani? Uh, punish people? Hi. Hi. The words you said to send those men... Scurrying. That was amazing. I want to be like you and berate people the way you do. Yeah. Uh, wait, I don't know. <laughs> yes! I want to change myself. Please help me. Hell yeah! She's desperate enough to ask for my help, even though we just met. She must be serious about wanting to change. Not sure how I can teach her how to berate others, but if she thinks she could... 
If if but if she thinks I could help, uh, okay, I'll do what I can to help. <laughs> oh, you will? Thank you. My name's Ayu. I'm so glad I met you. Uh, I'm Kiryu. Mm. But now what? I don't know where to begin. That's true. Uh, for now, though, there are too many people here. May we go to the park, please? Uh, okay. <laughs> my, my man here is just like, yeah, sure. Yep. Mm -hmm. Well, we're at the park. And now what? I'd like to try walking through a session with you. Yes, in public. Yes, please. Mm -hmm. Oh, uh, how does that work? S&M is about play acting, a certain kind of fantasy. It's a form of role playing, but it's not what you would expect. I think I could gain better insight into S&M if I were to practice with you. I want to act out a play session with me taking the dominant role and you, the submissive. Yes, 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 this is, this is amazing. This is amazing. I see, hey, hey, wait a second. I <laughs> kill you, he's just now cluing in. <laughs> Did you say I have to play the customer's part? Hi. Uh, yes, Kiryu-san. I want you to play the role of a thoroughly masochistic client. And as we do this, I'd like you to give me advice on what I should be saying as a dominatrix. Yeah. I get it, but... <laughs> I love that he's he's so, like, not ready for this. He's like, wait, I thought I was going to be training you. And he's like, uh, sure. I I'll just say things that come to my mind when I'm thinking of someone I'm pissed at, you know? But, uh, no. Uh, oh, oh, no. <laughs> Please, I want to change. If I can't do this, I'll end up as a quiet, dull person for the rest of my life. Yeah, chotto mate kudasai. She's laying the guilt on thick. Mm. I can see her point, though. It would do Ayu good to learn how to berate others with authority. Besides, I told her I would help. I can't back out now. All right, fine. I'm not doing anything weird, though. <laughs> sure, buddy, sure, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Great. Uh, thank you very much. Kiryu-san, can we start with you entering my chamber? <laughs> yes. Uh, I'll try. Let's, let's go. M mistress may I serve you today? <laughs> yes, please do. Mm. It, yeah, that's not right. <gasps> uh, pardon? Yeah. I'm not fully into my role either, so I'm not one to talk, but are you... You're a dominatrix, right? Y yes I'm supposed to be. Uh, before you can really dominate someone, you need to understand what it means to be a dominatrix. With this sort of thing, the beginning is crucial. Your first words have to lay out the rules. You're the boss. Uh, I see. Then how should I respond to the client's greeting? And please give us three dialogue choices! Yes! 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 Okay, chat, one, two, or three. One, two, or three, what do you want? Your parents would cry if they knew you were here. Who gave you the permission to speak, pig? It's not like I'm happy to see you or anything. Ah! <laughs> yeah, let's do this, yeah. I'd say, it's not like I'm happy to see you or anything. By saying their visit doesn't make me happy at all, I show the client I'm above them. Uh, right. Being unable to draw their mistress's attention has to be humiliating. Okay, can we do this from the top again? Hell yeah! Mistress, may I serve you today? It's not like I'm happy to see you or anything. Oh, that's heartbreaking. <laughs> I know I told her to do this, but what am I doing? <laughs> this is so good! Kiryu watches so much anime! You know that Kiryu watches that really adorable, like, father-daughter's, like, sweetness and lightning shit. Kiryu, Kiryu watches slice of life, like, really adorable, like, like, really cute, like, moe, like, like, yeah, old school moe anime. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so how are you going to serve me today? Nani? Huh? <laughs> um, please tell me what you'd like me to do. S&M comes in many flavors. I have to get the client to tell me about their particular kink. Yes, we need to reveal Kiryu's kink. Uh, got it, but I don't really have anything in particular. I guess not. Th then, 
just in general, what do you want women to do to you, Kiryu-san? Tell me! Oh my god, we get to decide! Um, what do I want done to me? Nothing really comes to mind. So let's just play the masochist here. Hmm. One, two, or three, chat. One, two, or three. Three again. Okay, all right. Let's go three. Hell yeah. Uh, I want to be stepped on with your heels. Ew. Is that right, Kiryu-san? I never would have guessed. Yeah. Uh, I don't really want that done. It's just an example. Besides, that's the wrong response for a dominatrix. Pardon? <laughs> she keeps using pardon. Telling you their kink makes them vulnerable. You need to come back with the right response to maintain trust. I see. Then how should I respond? Wow. Yeah, one. Okay, let's do one. Go with gross. I'm the only one who'd do that for you. Nobody else would do that, but I'll do what you want. By saying that to the client, I make them think of me as someone special, is that it? Uh. Yeah, exactly. You're the only one who can satisfy their cravings. Make your clients believe that so you can dominate them. Okay, can we try this again? Mistress, I would like you to step on me with your high heels today. Gross. I'm the only one who'd do that for you. Mistress, what am I doing with my life? <laughs> Very well. We shall begin. Uh, hi. What are you guys doing? Yes, I was waiting for this! I was waiting for the kids to be like, uh, can you guys, like, go do this somewhere else? This is kind of weird. <laughs> oh. Oh, wow. Miss, your clothes are so pretty. <laughs> yes. Are you having fun? Can we play too? Uh, chotomate, chotomate, chotomate. No, 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 no. Uh, guys, this isn't. We're not playing. You see, um. Wait, are you? Calm down. How could you expect me to stay calm now? Please, can we leave? Yeah. No, think about it. Wouldn't a true dominatrix take advantage of any un unexpected situation to enhance the session? Wait, what? No! 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 Stop! No! 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 Kill you! What are you doing? Oh, I see. That does make sense. Well, then, what do you propose I say? Answer me. Good. I use back in control. In a situation with kids watching, what would a dominatrix say to a masochistic client? Jet, what do we do? Oh no, you guys, you guys like all of these options. Oh wait, one, everyone, everyone likes one the most. Okay, we're doing one then. You should goad him with, they're watching you get humiliated. <laughs> oh, I see. Being seen could be a big thrill for masochists. Pointing that out would make it even more thrilling and titillating for them, right? <laughs> Good, now you're getting it. I understand now. Can we pick up where we left off? This... This quest, oh my god. Come on, what are you talking about? M -m Mistress. <laughs> Come on, admit it. You like this, don't you? They're watching you being humiliated. Oh, this is actually pretty humiliating. I don't get this game you're playing. <laughs> Grown-ups are weird, let's go. I'm so sorry. It was just training, but I caused you embarrassment in the process. Uh, I think I lost some dignity among other things, but it's worth it if it helps you change, Ayu. <laughs> oh, thank you. Kiryu-san, can you come with me to the dungeon? I want to give you something as my thanks. Sure. Well, well here we go. Dungeon time! I'm gonna make like a... Like a D&D &D player and uh, explore this dungeon fully. Hmm. I think I left my bag somewhere around here. I should have something that would make a good token of my appreciation. 
So you bring your personal belongings into the playroom? Ayu-chan, you've got a client. He requested you personally. I'll send him through, so get ready, okay? Huh? Uh, yes? Oi. Whoa, if you've got clients coming in, I shouldn't be here. Oh my gosh, we're gonna have to hide in the closet and watch and listen and... <clears throat> no, you're right, but this could actually be a great opportunity. A yes. Nani? N Nani? <laughs> what, what do you mean? <laughs> I'm going to put what I learned from you into practice, Kiryu-san. So, could you hide somewhere and watch how I do- Yep! Yep, of course. Of course. You've got a lot more guts than I thought. Uh. I never imagined I'd get roped into watching over an S&M session. But, alright, I'll do it. Give it your best. Hi. I will. Wow. And it's the same guy. Are you Jen? I'm back! That's the guy who told Ayu she was a bad dominatrix. Ayu-chan, I want to see how much you've grown as a dominatrix since our last time. Now, mistress, may we begin? Hmm. <laughs> she looks at us! Go on, Ayu. Show him what you learned. I am not happy to see you or anything. Not in the least. Oh! Mistress, your words, they send little shocks to my heart, like, oh, I, I don't understand it, but it's adorable. What? Why, why would you say something like that? It's not like I care what you think anyway. But I'm glad you came. Oh, 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 oh. I know I told her to try that, but it's not exactly the traditional dominatrix thing, is it? Well, as long as the client's happy. So, what shall I subject you to today? Hi. Uh, please, mistress, I beg you to whip me. Then, while I lie humiliatingly exposed, step on me with your pin heels. Ew, that's gross. Nobody else would do something that embarrassing for you, you know. But I will. <laughs> Oh, this demeanor, it's not exactly a dominatrix, but something other than S&M thrills sends jolts through my heart like little Cupid's arrows. Oh, I can't resist. Quit talking and assume the position. You tease. Oh, oh. Hard to tell if my advice helped, but the client seems satisfied anyway. I'm getting really uncomfortable back here, <laughs> yes! Wait, wait, wait! We're gonna be the kids! We're gonna be the kids! She's gonna get to practice doing this in front of someone else watching! I need to move a little. Huh? Did you hear that? Ah! Damn it. They heard me. Is... Is someone there? I'm busted now. Hey. Uh, you you don't work here, do you? Ayu chan, who is this guy? Mm. Ayu, how will you get out of this one? He's your audience. Hey. My, my audience? <laughs> I decided to have someone watch you be humiliated. Well, don't you find it kinky? Oh, oh! <laughs> You like it, don't you? You pig, your flabby body's on display for everyone. Or at least, this man to see. P please degrade me! A total stranger is watching me in my mortal shame, ooh! She applied what I told her. Good going, Ayu. She's got a real knack for this. I, I don't know what I expected, but... It, yeah. Yeah, there we go. Thanks for the play session, Ayu-chan. Ayu-chan, you're role-playing. To be honest, you don't make a very good dominatrix. Oh, no. But it gave me more pleasure than SNM. Your haughty behavior that hides a sense of syrupy dependence. So prickly, and yet so sweet. A new age in SNM dawns! Yep. It's, uh... S and M and T. 
Please allow me to keep requesting you Ayusama. Oh, Ayusama now. Well, what are you saying? I'm not gonna wait for you to come see me again. I won't wait. More than a week. Oh! 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 <laughs> Ayusama, I'll be back next week. Farewell. Good job, Ayu. Oh, Kiryu-san. Was that a success? Mm. Mm. Your clients seem to be happy. And that's the important part, right? <laughs> You're right. Please accept this token of my thanks. You got a collapsible steel staff. Shit, okay. Kiryu-san, I'm going to keep applying your enigmatic techniques in everything I do. I'm not sure I became more dominant, but I know I've changed a little, Kiryu-san. Thank you for helping me. Uh, yeah, good to hear, Ayu. Hi. You can come see me as a client next time if you want, Kiryu-san. <laughs> Not that I'd be happy to see you or anything. Hey! Hey, let's go! Ayu seems to be more confident in this new archetype she's invented. I don't quite get it, but good for her. Wow, that, that, that un unironically was, uh, was really good. Well, we'll find out. Ah. <laughs> へやで待ってろと言われた。それは何かの間違いじゃないですか。おう、シェ。何何うちの小田ってもんから連絡が入ってましてね。若いチンピラが来るだろうから死なない程度に可愛がってやれ。おう、オッケー。なんだと。小田
部下に襲わせるだけで俺の何がわかんだ Yep, yeah, here we go. Yep, but you wouldn't be able to get a little bit of 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 a l i t t I like Oda. 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 Yeah. Oh, my God, the blood. Just trading. Alright. That's a bit boring of a way to kill him, but we're not really killing him. So. Yeah, be style is too slow. Yeah, he just let it happen, yeah. Hey, Oreno. Eh, Marquette, おださんは私にとって掛けがえのない片腕です。だから我々の中にあなたを迎え入れるには彼の了解を取る必要がありました。そうかよ。俺はつくづく自分がバカに思えてきたぜ。さっきまであんたらは信用してもいいって気になりか
いいでしょうですがその前に、うん、あなたはこのカムロ町という町を何と見ますかカムロ町<笑>さあな質問の意味がわかんねえ私はねキリュウさんこの町は道島組をはじめとする登場界の餌場であると見ていますうん一晩中ネオンに彩られたこの町に集まる人や金そこから溢れる甘い汁は全て登場界の極道たちに吸い上げられる Yeah, that's, that's fair. Yeah. 登場界が力で光り輝かせるこの町に私は風穴を開ける人間ですこんなふうにねウォーウォーウォーウォーウォーなんだとファー金は力私は自分の力がこの先どこまで登場界に迫れるか試してみたい<笑>ですがスタンドパワーまだまだでしてね<笑> And it's back up again. 今の私ではせいぜい10秒というところが限界ですが。It's like he's revealing the limits of his stand. からの一つを手に入れて。With a range of three kilometers. 支配者層に食い込むつもりです。あの土地はそれだけの価値を生みます。あんたは一体。キリュウさんがご存知かどうか、登場界という組織は決して一番。Oh, I'm aware. I'm aware. Yeah. その証拠に登場界にはこの私に協力するある一人の人物がいます。Yeah, here we go. Here we go. そして私があなたに近づいた理由はその人物から協力の推薦を受けたからなんです。Yep. 登場界の。No, not just a mole. Someone big. 誰なんだそいつは。Who do you think? あなたと私が手を結ぶことを望んだその人物は、yep. 登場界直系、道島組若頭風間慎太郎です、mm -hmm. な,なんだと、yep. Yep. おやっさんが、mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. あなたは道島組の若頭補佐クゼさんから風間さんをスパイするように言われましたね。風間さんの隠し持つ。さあ、からの一つぼの情報を探れと。風間さんが隠し持っていた情報。それは。からの一つぼの所有者を見つけ出すことのできる人間。つまり。私のことです。It's a very convoluted.、Uh... Indirect line of connections. I don't know if you can see that. 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 私が風間さんから言われたことです。キリュウさんが、私は信じないよ。あの人、あの人が刑務所に入るよりも前のことです。Oh shit。風間さんは、six months ago。クゼがあなたに近づくことも、あなたが組にいられなくなることもほぼ見通していました。計画通り。いくらお休んでもそんなことまでわかるわけないだろう。風間さんは同島組どころか登場会という組織で。頂点へ上り詰める人間です。His abilities. He possesses a stand known as epitaph. あまりに深い。風間さんにとってあなたの周りに起こること。No, Tachibana is our half brother. たやすいはずです。そして
like our older half brother. おそらく自分の身を守るなどということじゃない。あの人はもっと大きなものご理解いただきましたか。キリュウさん。立花。あんたがおやっさんの意思を託された人間だって証拠は。What Shit。あなたにこれを渡したのか。あなたにお渡しするよう預かっていただけです。あなたから風間さんにお返しください。全てが片付いた後で。Damn。The the only thing that could make this to where this isn't actually him being manipulated is that Kazuma is actually dead and he's like in prison, but he's never actually seen him in like a long time. And this is just him being manipulated still by Tachibana. But we'll see. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Not nice. Cool to tie that back in. では、これから。どうぞ。よろしくお願いします。キリュウさん。shit. Okay. <clears throat> Chapter 2, the real estate broker and the shadows completion bonus. 3 million earned. <laughs> 3 million. It's nothing. Because we lost so much money through mini games. <laughs> A gilded cage. Okay. Oh, new location! New location! Oh, shit! Cabaret! Jacob! The place! The place you've told me so much about! Oh. Oh, okay. Chug, 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 chug. Oh my gosh. This place. What the fuck? おお、マイゴッド。へえ、これはすごいね。東京でもこんなに派手な店は見たことないよ。そりゃもう、ここが何をノンバーワンの店です、坂井。オッケー。総天堀来て、グランドへ寄らんやなんて、タコなしのタコ
こっちってこれもん多いって話じゃないそうないなことありまへんてもう先生何べん言うたら信じてくれはるんですかでも蒼天堀って言ったらあの大海連合のお膝元でしょ町ごとのヤクザクみたいなもんだろ so another yakuza group. Okay. <笑>ましてやこの手の店なんてもうあ,あそこの席あれ絶対ヤクザだよやっぱり私帰るよ大丈夫ですってほんまに物騒な店も確かにありますけどこの店に限っては絶対安心折り紙付きですあああれは確かにヤーさんやけどこの店じゃおとなしゅうしてますよ<笑>妙にこの店の方を持つねまあまあ細かい話は抜きにしてさあさあまずは座って一杯やりましょうねえオーラーさあオーマイガーオッケーでもねこんばんは。失礼します。失礼します。Oh my. Oh. <笑>いや。こんばんは。どうです。女の子も粒揃いですやろ。このお方な。東京のでっかい会社のお偉いさんやで。ほら、君らも顔を売っとき。<笑>やっぱり偉いさんなんや。なんか貫禄ある思った。東京から来はったんですか。かっこええですね。こっちには陽気はるんですか<笑> ?This guy's getting worked. いや、今回はたまたま出張でね。Big time. ここもこの人に無理やりね。そう、せやから君らがたっぷりサービスしてくれんと、あたしの面目丸つぶれ。頼むで。<笑>なんや、責任重大やわ。じゃあ、まずはお飲み物からやね。何言っちゃいますどれ Hundred thousand. What? Champagne is a good one. Oh, my God, this is how. 東京の偉いさんもおるのに、一本やと足りひんのとちゃいます。大阪の人間がケチや思われますよ。ちょっと君だ。This, this is, なるほど。This is incredible。確かにその通りや。よっしゃ。ここは潔く。一人一本いっとこか。ほな四本やね。お前らの分もかい。ねえわ、ええわ。四本いっとれ。さすが、男前。We'll just spend four thousand dollars on the first,、uh, the first bottles. Oh, my God! <laughs> All right, this is a crazy cutscene. この店が有名になったのはつい最近なんですよ。Yeah, yeah, it's, it's ええ、少し前に支配人が変わって、そこから急に。ああ、the management change。そんなに変わるもんかね。それが引き抜きから何からちょっと大声では言えんようなことまでつい始まったみたいで。Oh my god。箱のデカさだけが。Is this gonna be us? Is this going to be us? Are we going to, are we going to be the manager?、Uh, this, is, this is too good. <laughs> お前もまんざらやないんやろなわけあるかもうすっごいほらごごやごごやお客様当店はおさわり禁止ですどうかその辺でかわいやっちゃなお
Well, well, you've got about five seconds. Yeah. Oh, shit. Well, this guy's gonna get his ass beat. Here we go. It'll be over in a sec. Oh, here we go. <laughs> He'll come handle it. Oh, my God. Oh, the Ultra Giga Chad. Here he is. Oh, my God, with the ponytail and everything. Oh, shit. Oh, and an eye patch. <laughs> oh, no way. Oh. ありがとうございます。ああ。ですが、違います。ああ。せやったら何やねん、俺。He's Majima. Oh, I've heard you say this guy's name, Jacob. Eh? どうかご遠慮願います。おい。君ご安ちゃんやったら。力づくできてみろや。え。そのつら書き落としけ。そういうわけには参りません。お客様は神様ですから。What?He's <笑> God, with all the lights and everything. Ha <laughs> 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 <笑>私はこの先を一度浴びるように飲んでみたかったのですが。そろそろお引き取り願いませんでしょうかもしこれ以上営業妨害されますとそろそろ。All the musicians are going to start pulling out blades in a second. しゃあないの。あ。いや。一丁ケーキのやれ。Oh. Oh. He's going to beat his ass to the music. そこまでお客様がお望みならこの間島。ただし私からは一切手出しはいたしません。何しろ。お客様は神様ですから。まだそんなこと抜かすかい。やめよって。さあ、ショータイム。ショー <笑> time。Drunkards. Oh my god.
First law of management, the customer's king. Even if punched or kicked, reprisal is out of the question. For now, watch for the customer to move and evade their attacks using A. God, we're so fast. Look at our feet movement. The customer's king. Even the worst of times, you must never forget to provide only the finest service possible. Patience shall be rewarded. As now it is time to show all your customers the ultimate in hospitality. Okay. <laughs> Wait, what? What? Don't you do it. Don't you do it. Don't you do it. なめんな。危険ですので、こちらはお預かりいたします。ああ。わお。わお。ありがとうございます、シハニー。お静かに。こちらのお客様はご覧の通り店内での違反行為を繰り返し、皆様へご迷惑をおかけしました。本来ならばこのまま警察へ出頭していただくべきだと存じます。Oh, こちらのお客様、このまま警察へ突き出されれば、これまで気づかれた社会的地位を失うことになりましょう。一時の気の迷いに対する報いとしては、あまりに酷ではないでしょうか。No よるの世界の流儀として酒の席での失態は酒で注いでいただきたいのですおおバイトンズオブアルコールすべてお客様がご馳走してはくださらないでしょうかわっ想定制約営業本部長様おおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおお
この店がナンバーワンになった理由が分かった気がするよ彼を見るとみんなそう言いますキャバレーグランドの支配人マジマゴロゴロマジマゴロマジマ夜の帝王中やつですわ。わお。Yeah, I wrote a blog post a while ago why I fucking hate video games because this is what it does. It appeals to the male fantasy. My man here got his entire getup soiled and prostrated himself, showed zero ego in this whole situation where he absolutely styled on the guy. Oh my god. Oh. Does he see this guy often? For his night smoke. Oh, interesting. Shihani, Sakihodo, Arigato, Gozamasta. It's most of me, my son. For a doya, what's the other? Ah, hi, Arakata, Moto, no Torini. Tada de no merito, Akate, Chumonga, Kirina, she does here. そうかあいつら怪我はいえ突き飛ばされたおののやつもこれと言ってマキちゃんにはボーナス弾んだれよ Hell yeah give her a give her a huge bonus yeah モチベーションガタ打ちやはいそれは先んじて伝えておきました Way to go ならええわあの暴れてたドアホ一応見張っときや名刺は押さえちゃうがトンズラコカンとも限らんからな。Oh, interesting. The way he speaks to the floor manager is different than how he spoke out there. Like he has a lot more like, like a lot more slang. Okay. 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 おんなっちゅうのはほんま面倒くさいの。私からも話はしてみたんですが、なかなか。またあった。俺からも話ししとく。すみません。お手数ですが、お願いします。失礼します。Oh. I wonder how much of the um I wonder how much also of the performance that he did out there was an act specifically like you know give the best representation for the business and stuff may as well go see her now and get this over with she's probably in the dressing room i i am fucking floored y'all i am absolutely fucking floored i i don't think there's a better character introduction in a video game i've ever like that i've ever experienced Hi, sir. Uh, nice working out there tonight. Uh, thanks, Kanai-chan. So, you wanted to talk to me? You said she was locking horns with Sakurako. Hmm, where do I start? Hmm. Hmm. We lay down the law. The hell do you think you're doing, dummy? What? I... What? What's this about? That's the question, isn't it? Think long and hard. Does anything come to mind? What? Sorry, but you've got to be a little more specific. I guess that was a little out of the blue. It's been about a month since you came on here, yeah? How's it going? Think you can make a real go of it at the Grand? Oh, I... I think so. The hall's much bigger than the last club I worked at, so it was pretty daunting at first, but I'm totally used to it now. More and more customers are coming here specifically to see me. Oh yeah? That's great to hear. Not surprising from the number one gal from one of the oldest cabarets in the Kita area. Guess I was imagining things then. Hmm? What do you mean? 
Oh, see, the one month mark's actually when I see that most girls up and leave. I was a little worried you might be getting the itch, too. Oh, have no fear of that. I wouldn't dream of quitting now. That hag Sakuraka's been trying to play the seniority card on me, but I don't even notice her. Damn girl, hag. This is pretty serious. Aw, oh, don't be like that. Sakuraka's a vet here. She looks after the other girls, too. Most love that about her. Try to get along, yeah? Ugh, I hate nosy types like that. And she's got a whole entourage. Whatever, soon I'll have my own clique, and I won't have to deal with them. Does she even realize she's getting lectured here? Dense's a door, this one. She's even getting me a little... She's even giving me a little tood. <laughs> hmm... Uh, we should go more direct. Yeah. Yeah. Better make it loud and clear for her. That ain't right, can I, John? You gotta learn to read the room. Huh? Doesn't matter how good you are at your job or how popular you get. Keep snubbing your seniors like that, you wake up one day with nothing but enemies here. Fine by me. Not like I do this job to make friends with the other girls. Really? That's the best you can do? I'm disappointed. I doubt you'll be around here long enough to make those enemies then. W wait, what, what's that supposed to mean? Is there a problem with my work? Nailed it. She's the competitive type. Put her pride on the hook and she'll take the bait. Look, I ain't asking you to be friends with Sakurako-chan. In fact, you two make much better rivals. Rivals? Yeah, but not the kind that shanks the other in the back. Compete, push each other to get better. You'll bring up all the other girls with you. Right now, you're just tripping over each other, and that makes it harder for everybody around you to step up. Hmm. Customers may love a gal like that, but I got no use for him here. The Grand needs girls who are popular with the guys and the girls. The guys and the girls. Thing is, I know you could be that girl, Kanai-chan. That's the only reason I'm coming down on you about it like this. You really think... I'm sorry, sir, I was acting like a spoiled brat. I'll work on being that girl. I'm being more considerate, but please give me that chance. There, see? You do get it. I knew you were a keeper, kid. And I hope you'll keep... Uh, yeah, I hope you'll keep helping me improve when I need it. Yeah, finally. It took long enough. Okay, so he has his inner world of where he's dealing with everybody's shit. But he's amazing at presenting that, that really, like, strong, gentlemanly side of himself. Man. By the long face. Need to use the facilities. Oh, uh, sir. No, I got a letter from my little sister back home. Yeah, and what's the word? Uh, that my father's sick, unfortunately. The doc says he needs to be hospitalized, but the procedure they want to do runs 500000 But I ain't got that kind of cash. Sorry to hear it. You try asking the floor manager for an advance? Another emergency a while back already forced me to ask for one. I'm afraid if I ask again, I'll get canned. Especially for so much. You in the habit of breaking mirrors, kid? Here, I'll spot you. But what? But, sir, I can't. Don't sweat it. You can always replace money. Same can't be said about people. Once they're gone, that's it. Sir. That's why I recall. You ain't been back home in a while, yeah? Take a few days off, too. Go visit your pops. What is this? What is this guy? He's so amazing! Gah! So thank you, sir. Um, sir, there's a problem. Shit, what now? Uh, one of the customers is placing insane orders now that he knows he isn't paying for it. He went down the line of our top vintage wines to start, then started in our best whiskeys and brandies. He's already racked up about four million worth. Started the prices and worked your way down the list, huh? The real class acts come out in times like these. Indeed. I figured we should stop him, so... Uh, where's he at? Show me. Uh, right this way. Oh, he knows him? He knows him. Hmm. What did <笑>お客様。ちょっとお話があるのですが。ご足労願えませんでしょうか。なんだよ、人が気持ちよく飲んでんのに。お時間は取らせません。<笑> Shoga 
ねえな<笑>他ならぬ支配人さんのお願いだ This guy さてちょっくら行ってくるよあの支配人この方は俺が相手するお前は仕事に戻れはいわかりましたデイアムさあ参りましょうはいよ Mm, I love the like the one eye that's kind of squinting a little bit because of the、uh, alcohol. Hanjo Sturjanega. Three Konomai, but the Kankoduri and I did that to know. Kawareva Kawaramunda. God, all these fun <laughs> visual <laughs> details are so extra. そう邪険にすんなよマジマちゃんちょいとお前さんの働きぶりを確認しになこれも仕事だまあただで飲めるとは思ってなかったけどな来るならちょっとは行儀をしてくれんか<笑>客が減るっちゅあ<笑>、ah, here we go おそいつはすまなかったな here we go ついはしゃいじまったよ music shifting I love how he prepped the ashtray knowing this guy's a heavy smoker, so he's like, I don't want him messing up my couch or anything, so I'm gonna give him a, a tray that's ready to receive the、uh, cigarette. Yeah. What do you want? やっぱりお前、カタが向いてるって。自分でそうは思わねえの。アホのカズ。誰がこんなこと好きでやるかっちゅう。わお。そりゃお前、今の立場のありがたみっていうのが分かってねえよ。金も地位も名誉もある。ところや女だってずいぶん寄ってくるだろう。おお。そんなことは望んでないってか。皮肉なもんだ、hmm. そんな誰もが羨む立場を得たお前だけがただ一人この町で別の何かを求め、yeah. <笑>幸せってやつはいちいち意地悪にできてるらしい今日はずいぶんおしゃべりやないかしけた面のお前を見てたらなんとなくなでもまあこの現状お前が気に入らないのは当然だこれはお前への罰なんだからな。おお、シェ。楽しまれちゃ、俺もシマノの兄弟もちっと困る。そろそろ本題に入ってくれまへんか。俺はいつになったら国道に戻れる。わあ。おお。でん。That's such a cool casual reveal. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Damn. この調子なら来月にはノルマの1億。わーおおそりゃすごいとぼげんな達成したら島野の親父に俺が極道に戻れるよう口聞きする。約束忘れてへんやろな。わーさあ、I love this! 約束したっけかなこの件で冗談は通じひんぞ。ダメだ。あと5億稼げそうしたら口聞いてやるよえおのれなんだ殴らねえのかまあやれるわけないけどなはあそんなことしたらお前はあの暗い場所に逆戻りだ。それは嫌だろうからな。Alright, this is how we're gonna play this. 
これがお前の戻りたがってる世界のやり方だよヤクザがお前みたいな金づる、yeah. 簡単に手放すわけない You're doing too well. Yeah. Fuck. やっぱり肩着の方がいいんじゃないか。上等や。五億やろうがないやろうがなんぼでも稼いだろう。極道に戻るためやったら、俺は何でもやったるわ。ほう、何でも。ああ、そうや。それが殺しでも。おお。おお。どうした。おお。おお。なお。極道に戻れるとしたら。お前は人。殺せるの。おお。めえ。冗談だよ。いや、意地悪いってすまなかったな。極道ならいずれそういう山を踏むこともあるお前にそれが分かってるのかちょっと聞いてみたかっただけだから、yeah. 引き続きよろしく頼むよ支配人This man is about to punch あそうだ一つ忘れてるここのホステスに乗り込っているだろうそれがどないしたそいつ、明日から別の店でやらせることにしたから。No. No. 即戦力が欲しくてさ、ノリコ、ここのナンバーワンなんだろ、wow. おあつらいむきかと思ってよ。Fuck off! 本人にはもう伝えてあるから、こっちの方がよろしくな。売り上げ落ちないように頑張るよ。なんせあと5億稼がなきゃなんねんだからな。Fuck this guy! はぁ。Yep, yep, yep, yep. Sweet, I must say. Oh, she hiding. I'm a Noriko Chankara, a stucker, a yoson, you would sort of the demoga. Ah, Ormosaki store. Cosonji de Staka, Nanda de Conacuni, Noriko Changa in a canatara, Uriagini Soto, he becomes you. I got to say, I get owner someone go get there. God damn it. Ah, I'm so invested. I'm so invested in this guy's story already. I just met him. I'd do anything for him. Oh. そうかじゃあ一丁行ってくるかな Let's hit the road. あの支配人どちらへ決まっとるやろ<笑>望みをうちに引き抜く Damn. ライバル店のナンバーワンを引き抜くってさすがにまずくないですかそもそもそんなことどうやって夜の世界は弱肉強食ここでこけたらうちはあっちゅう間に崩れるでやるなしゃあない店の方は任せたでわ<笑>かりました<笑>どうかお気をつけて Well Okay よし You there Oh my god Can't get like ten steps away from the cabaret Huh? What? 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 You are the master of that alehouse, the Grand, yes? Hi. Uh, yes, that's me. I knew it! Even the way you walk is refined. Guarded! You have no blind spot, despite appearances. I'm sorry, sir, have we met? My name is Somotaro Komeki, heir to a certain form of martial arts and its present master. Martial arts? Yes. But lately, I've felt my technique slipping. My edge has been dulled, so I left the lights of Tokyo in order to trade. Mm. Yet even here, I find this age of excess gluttons and fools gorging on carnal pleasures. Nobody hungers anymore. And I heard talk of a lounge called the Grand. They said it was the home of a most interesting man. Pardon my asking, but why have you visited our establishment? Mm? 
What kind of question is that? Guzzling booze with painted ladies hanging all over you? Bah! Want an excess? Of course I haven't been. <sighs> well then, why the hell am I doing the song and dance if you ain't a customer? Besides, what's a washed up martial artist want with me? That hungry air about you is far beyond the men I fought in recent years. Would you do me the honor? Which honor? What? You want me to fight you? I just stepped out the place. This guy has been here, but he's been outside for two seconds. Why? Precisely. A deeper strike sleeps within you. I refuse to let it lie dormant and unused any longer. You okay upstairs, pal? Fighting you don't earn me one skinny yen's profit. I'm a busy guy. Hide behind your merchant's guys all you like. I know money isn't what feeds that hunger. Money exactly feeds that hunger. Money is my XP. Whatever honest life you make a show of living, I can see the demon gnawing at you inside. Ugh. There's only one way to appease the demon, son. Face the strong in combat, and set loose your mouth upon the money. It will make you stronger. Set loose those fighting instincts struggling to burst free. And you're telling me you're that strong guy? <laughs> ho ho! As it happens, I am! Now do you see a reason to face me? Not that it will stand my hand, stay my hand either way. There's no talking sense in you, is there? Fine, you win. I was just thinking it's been a while since I could really cut loose. No, it hasn't, Majima! We got our loose cut, if you know what I'm saying. So, no. Not here, though. Hmm. If you insist. This place should work. Mm. Mm. You are awfully unhesitant in agreeing to this. I am starting to think you keep the true extent of your strength hidden away. You must have your reasons. I know I have mine. Uh, but the fist is like the sword. Leave it in its sheath to rust, and you will not be able to draw it when it's needed. What say you? Ever feel an urge to shrug off your restraints and fight to the full extent of your abilities for a change? Uh. If you're offering, I'm game. I'm not too big on the idea of opening up a can on a creaky old guy like you, though. Ho! Oh, cast aside such worries. Even dulled the edge left in me should prove sufficient to handle a pup like you. Show me everything you've got. Why are people watching? Okay, Thug Style incorporates a number of merciless attacks. One of them, one of these is the Eye Poke Attack. If you land an Eye Poke Attack, the enemy will turn their back to you in pain. Okay. The Essence of Choking. This heat action triggers when an enemy attacks you or when you circle around behind them. Oh, nice. Ah! <laughs> okay. God, that's so brutal. What? 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 What was that move? Mm. Glad to know I still have an eye for talent. You will surpass me one day, I can promise you that. Hey, Gramps, uh, just what kind of life you've been living? One of unarmed combat, wagering my life on my own bare fists for the last few decades. Not that my opponents have always been so gracious. I have faced swords, firearms, and you're thinking I'm gonna get stronger. Soldier. Much. Even now I see there's been a change in you. I spar with you and regain the strength I once had. You spar with me and gain strength you've never known. A mutual benefit for us both, is it not? Uh, yeah, I guess. I will be walking about the city for a while. You shall see me again when the time comes. All right, I'll be waiting, old man. Now, if there are no more weird old guys to interrupt me, I gotta go pluck Nozomi from the Odyssey roster. Odyssey's in Shofukucho. I could head straight there, but it wouldn't hurt to gather some intel first. I should take a lap around town and see what kind of info I can dig up on Club Odyssey from the people living in it. Oh, ah, that's Matsu, one of our barkers. He'd have inside and tell the other clubs. My man, Matsu-san, business been good? A uh, new week is a new wallet, Majimahan. You? Oh, doing fine, thanks to you. As long as you keep the customers coming, I can't complain. Aw, sell on that humility shit and rotate. We both know the Grand's only shooting up because of you. 
What's it been? Two years? The Grand's blasted off like a damn rocket ship since the since the day you turned up in Soton. I've seen some salesmen in my time, but I ain't never seen one like you. What'd you do before this, Majima Han? Huh. No rearview mirrors on rocket ships, Matsu-san. Let me ask you a question instead. Yeah? What you got? Need the scoop on Odyssey. How they doing lately? Odyssey? Well... Not good. Nah, they're doing just fine. Don't get me wrong. Only guys in town that can keep pace with you and the Grand. It's just... Just what? Less art, more matter, or some shit? Well, to tell you straight, it seems like they hit the ceiling. Been a while since they got any new blood. The regulars keep them afloat, of course, but that's a red flag. The floor manager's about to get canned. Between you and me, Yag Yamagata-han, the manager's looking to shake things up. I heard there's all sorts of changes going down over there. Wow, pink slip in the floor manager before profits even start to dip? That's pretty bold. But I get the picture. Thanks for the tip, friend. So Odyssey's manager is starting to panic. Music to my ears. Okay. Yeah, we can use that for sure. Oh. That's a bad sign. No. No, that's really low. Oh shit. Oh shit. No. Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, go for the the trip. Wait, no, 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 no. I'm telling you. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. We're still getting to the low numbers first. No! Okay, okay. What? What is happening? 20. 20. 20. Okay, okay. Fuck. All right, here we go. Yep, set up to do uh, 20 all day. Nice thump. Oh, fuck. This is it, this is it. We just hit the triple 20 once. There it is. There it is! Let's go! Let's go! Ah! Ah! Yes! Yes! Oh! 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 I've had enough. 15 million, baby. Let's rack it up! Let's rack it up! Caleb, I'd like to relay something my cousin told me about you just now. I have never heard of anyone bawling so fucking hard this early. <laughs>
good that's pretty good oh 92 91 all right ha oh. this one is gonna be a little easier but that's gonna be okay <laughs> oh my god majima you dork <laughs> Come on, baby! Come on, baby! Yay. Everybody say! Everybody say! <laughs> Holy fuck, Majima! <laughs> Wait, Ebisu socks. The more you walk in these strange socks, the more your money will multiply. They don't appear to have any effect in combat. Wait. Wait, we are making money by walking around. Can we turn off the sound for those? It's an intentional downside that you cannot mute the socks. Okay, so... 428902... Wait. 429802. Oh no. It is actually giving us a decent amount of money. Oh no. The min maxer in me is hurting. Because I have to wear them. But also, do I have to wear them? <laughs> oh, this could be info. Okay. Buckle up, kid, because I'm taking you to see the finest ladies this town's got to offer. My treat. You mean it? I, uh, I always wanted to try Odyssey. I hear the chicks there are ridiculously hot. Yeah, I've been there once. Can't say it was my scene. But really? But it's super popular and all the magazines give it rave reviews, so why is that? Well, yeah, the girls are cute. The service there is top notch. Certainly lives up to the hype. So where'd they go wrong then? It's the clientele. All the other guys there were these big shot businessmen and A-listers. Old men who could light their cigs with a wad of bills if they wanted. And the girls pick up the scent of cash like sharks. A couple of nobodies like us go in there and we'll be drowning in our sorrows as we get passed right up. Aw, oh, that really how it is there? Too rich for my blood. How about the Grand then? That place any easier for fresh meat like me? Ah, oh, the Grand's great. Fantastic, actually. That's where I was going to suggest anyway. Let's head out. Okay, so the Odyssey has older clientele. Gotcha. So Odyssey's a class act, but it's making everyone the everyone but the rich and wrinkled steer clear. If they don't get some new blood, they'll be screwed sooner or later. Okay, so we did end up getting some info. That's good. All right, let's get to work. Can't just charge in and blow my cover. He's Clark Kenning this shit. Oh, my man, my man. My man put on some glasses and is like, I'll just roll yes, right in. Oh, welcome to Odyssey, party of one. Ah. すみません。ただいま満席でして、少々待っていただいてもお構いませんでしょうか。かまへん、待つ。ほんますみません。そしたらこちらでお待ちください。ああ。よろしければ。Full up, but still not turning customers away. Nice. Still, I'll probably get in quicker if I don't put in a request for Nozomi. Mm. We're going to have to be real incognito here. 
at that big couch by himself. Wonder where Nozomi's at. Better scope things out first. Look around the club interior and then press the A button to observe areas of interest. Ooh, okay. That spot's looking pretty good. A pair of 50-something guys. Designer suits. Watches look Italian. Gotta be in finance, maybe real estate. Doesn't look like one's trying to impress the other. And they got a bottle on keep. Must be regulars. Judging from how hard these girls, they're talking those girls up, those guys are in pretty deep. Big fish like them are what keep a place like this running for... Or what keep a place running for years. Hmm. Not really feeling it. The hostess feels oddly old-fashioned. Like the clothes are screaming, Let's relive the college years. Maybe it's a classic look, but I say it's straight up dated. Guys their own age probably don't get anything from it, but I bet it makes the old boys club feel right at home. The fact that all the girls got the same look means it's probably club, po club policy. Not their personal taste. Hmm. That table's wide open. Thought this place was booked solid. Could be they keep a queue at the entrance even when there's space to make it seem like demand's high. Oh. That table's hopping. One old guy in flashy clothes, a middle-aged playboy, and a kid in rags. Gotta be entertainment biz. The director, the talent, and the young one's a PA or some piss boy job three customers and only two girls feels off balance hmm did I miss something y'all figures they wouldn't waste nosing me on a first timer still I can probably pump good intel out of this gal oh Oh no, I missed something. Okay, what's my plan of attack here? What do I ask to get info on Nozomi? Let's ask about her. Okay. Ah. あ、ああ。だ、せ、逆に見ついてもらうつもりないやろ。そうなんやさしいお客さんおらんもん。なな、今なら <laughs> 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 Ugh, why am I chatting this girl up like a tool? Damn near forgot why I came in. Okay, what's my plan of attack here? What do I ask to get info on Nozomi? Uh, ask about the hostesses here. それにしてもこの店は可愛い子が行さん揃ってるの。全部で何人くらいおるんや? So. One hundred. Oh shit. So very uh, very high turnover or very yeah, yeah, very high turnover. やめる。なんでや。うちは上下関係めっちゃ厳しいですし、ちょっとでも人気出そうな子が入るとすぐ上が潰しにかかるんですわ。シェ。競争が激しいっちゅうことか。せやけど、そんな田舎でも人気ある
ほんなら人気が出んのも当然やなあせやけど oh. oh. oh, shit. あ、今の内緒にしてな。うちがそないなこと言ってたのが他の子にバレたら大変なことになってしまうから。おお、ウィガットサムティー。いや、誰にも言わへんって。可愛いとこがあるやないか、その望みちゃんも。ナイス。サ
ま、yeah, we don't want to out, uh, we don't want to out, uh, Takako. Ooh. よう見てはるな。ま、賢いあんたのことや。そんだけ言えば俺の腹は伝わったやろ。こちらの事情は全て yeah. 10 million. Easy. Easy. あんたが目をつけた秘蔵庫をこっちに寄稿すと。ああ。倉庫を あんたは顔に似合わず敵作らんとうまいことやる方法を知っとるらしい。これがマジマ五郎のやり方っちゅう。ああ。交渉成立ってことでええな。ええでしょう。ただあんたんとことうちはライバルや。兄弟のはこれ
Whole point of business is giving your clients what they want. Sounds like an arms deal. This ain't something I want to get involved with. I deal only with clients I respect. If you would prove that you are worthy of my weapons, undergo my test. Huh? Test? The hell you want about now? You and I will spar. Defeat me and you pass. I'm getting real tired of your high and mighty talk. Fine, you want to fight? I'll take you. See how you like your precious can opener when I'm using it on you. <laughs> Indeed, that's the point. This is a test of your proficiency with a weapon. Ha! Huh. I ain't gonna feel sorry when you lose an arm or if I straight up end you. You dumb fuck! Holy shit! <laughs> oh, and now we have the weapons fighting style. Let's go. I have to know what this fighting style is called. It's not going to be just weapons. It's going to be like something like that, but... The hell are those moves with that stick? That's no martial art I've ever seen. But he's got the other dude's sword looking like a damn chopstick. Son of a bitch! You fail. Uh -huh. Yeah. Well, what do you expect giving me a shit sword like this? That staff you've got's a way better weapon. This is merely a, pierce, a piece of lumber. The sword you hold, on the other hand, is a masterwork I painstakingly crafted. <gasps> Crafting! What? <sighs> but apparently you're unfit to wield it. I would ask that you do not return to my shop again. Huh? To hell with your damn shop. I hope it burns with you in it. Rumor said you were the dealer to beat. So I went to the bother of tracking you down, and for what, you fraud? Shit, I've just been staring. Don't want to get dragged into somebody else's dirty dealing. I'm out of here. Uh. Ah, Majima. Curious meeting you here. Oh, it's you. Don't spook me like that, Gramps. I was merely wandering about in search of a place where the two of us could spar uninterrupted. That's so. Well, the Riverside's occupied at the moment. A real nasty customer at that. His name is Fei Hugh, a local arms dealer. Quite the master himself, too. So long as a weapon rests within his hands. Hmm? What? You know that guy? I knew his father for ages. Back when he walked this earth. Checking in on him was half my reason for coming to Sotenbori. As long as we are all here. As we all are here, why don't I introduce you? Hey, I didn't ask for any favors. Oh, don't be so stubborn. This will be good for the both of you. How do you figure? Besides, the time to sneak off has long passed. It seems Fei Hu has been aware of your presence from the start. What? <laughs> Apologies, Komeki-san, but I do not trust this man. He has an air of danger about him. Ha! Now don't you go being stubborn on me, too. Delay no longer, and put him to the test. I can tell you already, this young man will most certainly pass. Say what? <laughs> hmm. Why the hell do I gotta take a test? I got no business with this guy's shop. Come, come, Majima. I saw that look on your face as you bore witness to their fight. A look of inspiration. <sighs> and now your silence speaks volumes of truth. That curiosity of yours is one of the keenest tools in your armory. Yeah. Nothing fancy enough to call inspiration. Just a few dumb thoughts rattling around. Yes, but what if they were enough to match Fei Hu's skill? They would be less dumb, stray thoughts, and more akin to full-blown revelation. Yeah. <sighs> Whether you give that revelation life or snuff it out is your choice. Care to at least give it a try? <laughs> Listen, I've had a long ass day and I'm tired as a dog. Let's make this quick. I assume you have no objections, Fayhew. If you recommend him so strongly, very well. It is settled then. Now, what'll it be? 
This man, the man is an arms dealer. He can procure for you most anything you might want. Hmm. Nah, I'm good with that beat-up old bat over there. <laughs> yep. A baseball bat? Ho ho, this should be quite an entertaining match. Steady now. Oh, steady now. Begin! Slugger style! Try mastering the strong defensive potential that a bat offers. When you guard using a weapon, you're less likely to be staggered by an attack. I was, I was using it like a nunchuck. I certainly did not expect you to use a bat so well. You're quite the interesting fellow. Uh. I just remembered using one back when I was running raids on the competition. I think I've improved since then, though. Surprised me, too. I knew you could fight, but I did not think a spur-of-the-moment selection like that could get you far against Fei Hu. Shows what I know. So, uh, Fei Hu, right? What did you think of my bat work? Hi. You passed with flying colors, of course. You are precisely the sort of person my business exists to serve. Your weapons shop, you mean? That's nice of you to offer, but as you've seen, I ain't real interested in the conventional stuff. Heh. <laughs> so much the better. I'm not a common dealer pawning off weapons I've scavenged. Uh -huh. Well, that's cryptic. Uh, what do you mean? Are you free at the moment? My shop is quite close. I would enjoy the chance to escort you there and explain exactly what it is we do. Hi. This is our shop, the Dragon and Tiger. Uh, you could say it's quite hidden. Almost crouched by the river. Outwardly, a Chinese restaurant operated by myself and my wife. Uh, yeah. This is my wife, Long Hua. Mm. Hmm. New customer, yes? And many happy returns. And you said it was in your average weapon store. What exactly is it then? Hi. Most of the products we sell here are meticulously hand forged by me. Bespoke arms, you might call them. Made to order, huh? So you ain't an arms trader, you're a smith, is what you're saying. Precisely. Now, if I may, I would like to explain how it is I go about making weapons. Okay, at the Dragon and Tiger, you can enlist a host of agents to locate weapons, gear, and other equipment. They can be hired to hunt down the following three categories, gear, recipes, and parts. Okay. All right, put the agent skill to use and gather the world's most powerful weaponry equipment in your fingertips. Okay, cool. So we level this stuff up with our CP. So you send these agents around the globe looking for rare materials and such? That is pretty different. Hi. Our goal in all this is to develop a robust network with arms dealers the world over, but some agents' work takes them far from civilization. So, basically, you got these guys searching for treasure out in the jungle and shit. I'm all about that, actually. <laughs> Indeed, remote archaeological sites produce some of the most beautifully wrought and historically important weaponry. My shop is always on the lookout for such gems. Furthermore, customers whose contributions pass a certain level are given a special reward. Private arms lessons. Y yeah? So I'm guessing that means you were holding back when we fought out there? Naturally. That was only a test. Heh. <laughs> You're one slippery eel. Ah! Speaking of fish, I just remembered I ain't ate yet. I'm half starved to death here. You said this place is a Chinese spot by day, yeah? Give me the house special, would you? Ayah, you customer for that side of business, too? You wait, I fix you a feast. Majima, there's a favor I would ask of you. Huh? What now? I don't need to tell you not to spread word of their business, but I'd also ask you to keep vigil over them. Uh, why's that? The happy couple in some kind of trouble? I cannot share the details now, but in time their shot may draw the ire of a terrible foe. Uh, what's that supposed to mean? Nothing to worry yourself over just yet. I ask only that you drop by when you think of it. Perhaps buy something. Send them out on a search, that sort of thing. Uh, yeah, alright. I'm headed into the wilderness to train. Don't go letting that edge of yours dull, either. 
Hmm, what am I going to do? Oh, what to do? Y you Pretend to be my boyfriend. I can already tell where this is going. I excuse me? Huh? Uh, um, well, the thing is... You want something from me, don't you? Let's hear it then. Y yes. What I'm trying to say is... Uh, um... Listen, whatever you're chewing, I can take it. Spit it out. I... I have a favor to ask. Please be my boyfriend! I knew it! I knew it! I knew it! <laughs> uh, <laughs> Majima just sh shorts out. He's like, uh... <laughs> uh s s say what? Am I hearing you right? I said, please be my boyfriend. Please? Pretty please? What? Just like that? Your boyfriend? You mean like, you want to be a couple, go on dates? What the hell? <laughs> y yes, that's exactly it. That's what a boyfriend does. You be my one and only. B boyfriend, right, okay. Back it up a step or six. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> what the heck's with this little lady here? Just run up to me on the street, demand that I be her man? Every girl I meet these days makes me understand them less and less. <laughs> I gotta get it together. Can't let her know she got under my skin. I'll give her a strong answer, like, don't even think you've won, little lady. Oh my god! We gotta do three all the way? Yeah, I think you're right. Three is absolutely the way to go here. Sorry, darling. I got no interest in women. Huh? Uh, oh, okay, I mean, that's not a problem at all. But if you don't mind, could you set aside your preferences and just be my boyfriend for today? Yep, I knew it. I knew it. Yep. Uh, what are you talking about, girly? Oh, darn it. I've left out a few details, haven't I? No, but I, I picked them up. Yep. I should clarify, I guess. I need you to pretend to be my boyfriend. Not actually be my boyfriend. Excuse me? Pretend? Hi. Yes, you see, my father is visiting from back home, and he's demanding to meet my boyfriend. For several years now, he's been hounding me to meet suitors he's arranged for me. He was getting so persistent that I finally got fed up and I told him, I already have a boyfriend, so back off. I also told him my boyfriend is thin, wears an eye patch, a cool ponytail, and has a dangerous air about him. Kind of like the blade of a knife. Wait, no you did not! You're a fucking liar, girl! Why would you give him so many details? And why did you just describe me down to the buttons? I never thought I'd have to introduce him to my father, so I just kind of made it up as I went. You may not like it, but this is what the ideal man looks like. Right here? Right there? That's the ideal man. That's all she did. She was just like, mm, the ideal man in my head. Uh, th these things, yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But then Dad started saying, I have to see if this boyfriend is worthy of marrying you. So here I am, and I've got a big problem. Okay, I get the picture now. I fit the bills, so you want me to act like you're, I'm your man in front of your dad. Wow, you catch on fast. That's pretty much it. If dad finds out I don't really have a boyfriend, he'll force me into an arranged marriage with some strange man I don't even know. Please, nobody else looks anything like you. Could you be my boyfriend for just a little while? All right. The girl's in a pickle, all right. Who'd want to marry some guy they don't even know and end up spending the rest of their life with him? Fine. You painted yourself into this corner, but I feel your pain. I'll pretend to be your boyfriend. Yes! I'm so glad I didn't lose hope. Oh, my name is Kokoa. Please call me Koko-chan. Oh, and sorry, I didn't catch your name. I'm Goro Majima. I see. Then Majima-san, I will address you as Goro-chan. Goro-chan? We just met. That's taking things a little fast, don't you think? N no, no. I know it's just pretend, but we are in a romantic relationship. We can't be so formal with each other. We have to make this believable. Um, if you say so. Yes, I do. Well, let's not waste any more time. We should be going. Like, right now. <laughs> Wait, what? What if there's a big brain twist here, and she's like, 
Nah, I made all that shit up, and I was just really desperate for a boyfriend because I just went through a really rough breakup, and I wanted a really hot guy to just, you know, comfort me in these trying times. So she's gonna get him to go on a bunch of dates with her, and then he's like, let's meet your dad. And she's gonna be like, my dad died when I was a baby. <laughs> <laughs> huh? I'm getting exhausted already. And what's this about going? Going where? Oh, come on, try to keep up. We're going to the restaurant where we'll meet with my dad over dinner. The three of us. Oh, okay, never mind. We're gonna meet over dinner? I got nothing to say to your dad, Coco Chen. Make it so we meet, shake hands, and then let me go, why don't ya? Bing bang boom. Yeah, bing bang boom. Yep. Yep. Majima, I fucking love you. <laughs> Oh, no, that won't work at all. Dad won't be reassured unless I show him what kind of a man my boyfriend is. We have to go now, Goro-chan. Get a move on. Damn, she's gonna work you. Damn, I didn't know what I was expecting. But here we are, here we are. <laughs> so, Goro-chan, this is where we'll meet my father. I only have two requests. Please don't reveal that you're just pretending to be my boyfriend. And don't anger him. You got it. But what's all this about making him angry? Your dad get pissed off easily? Oh no, he's just stubborn. He's not scary though. He, he seems to think I'm not the sharpest tool in the shed, and he babies me more than he should. But underneath it all, he's as good a father as I could ask for. Well, I suppose it's tough to blame the guy. If I had a daughter like you, I'd be pretty worried too. You see? So if you start saying a bunch of weird stuff, He'll blow his lid and be all like, Forget this guy. I'll arrange your next date. So let's avoid that. No problemo. So, uh, let's go over my boyfriend's backstory now. Uh, excuse me? I need a backstory? Uh, we've been going out for six months. You're a dentist who likes going out on drives and watching movies. And your favorite food is the omelet rice I make, okay? No! No! Why can't we just use our actual story? No! No! Alright, six months. Dentist. Drives. Movies. And omelet rice that she makes. Okay. Uh, what was all that just now? I had to give my dad some details about my boyfriend, so I made stuff up. If he gets curious, can you make sure you've got it memorized? Oh no. Well, you ain't exactly making this a walk in a park. How am I supposed to remember all those details? Fine. From the top. We've been going out for six months. You're a dentist. You like going out drives and watching movies. And you love the omelet rice I make, okay? Uh, I'll give it my best shot. There he is, Dad, over here. Well, that's a bad sign. So this is Coco Chan's dad. Unlike his space case of a daughter, he seems pretty buttoned up. He literally has his jacket unbuttoned. Goro Chan, this is my father. Yeah, I've got it memorized. Hello, I'm Kokoa's father. Uh, pleased to meet you. And this is the man I'm seeing, Goro Majima-san. You know, now that I think about it, meeting a girl's dad for the first time is super important for a normal couple. This could end up making an impact on the rest of her life. Guess I better buckle down and get into this role properly. No different than at the Grand, right? Yes! Exactly! Exactly, Majima! What a, what a man! Let's go! The first impression's key. What do I open with? Ah. <laughs> Please make my miso soup every morning. Oh my god. Wow. Nah, we just keep it professional. Pleased to meet you, sir. I'm Goro Majima. Majima-kun, was it? I understand my daughter looks to you for a lot of support. Support? Oh no. In fact, it's quite the opposite. Koko Asana stood by me at every turn. Well, how courteous of you. Dame Dame is in the background! Something that gets to me these days is the erosion of courtesy in today's youth. So many can't even manage a proper introduction. You seem different, Majimo-kun. Uh, that's right, Dad. Goro-chan's not like those stereotypical men. Ugh, good. The first impression went well. Playing the respectful type was a pretty slick move. Majimo-kun, must say I'm surprised. You really do exist. <laughs> I beg your pardon? Well, my daughter described you as a man who is tall yet slender-waisted. 
sports an eye patch, has long hair tied back, and emits a deadly aura, not unlike a dagger's edge. <laughs> he memorized it too. I never imagined such a man could actually exist, yet here you are in the flesh. See, Dad? I told you I wasn't lying. My boyfriend's right here in front of you. Yes, I figure he was another figment of your overactive imagination, so I'm really quite shocked. Huh? Overactive imagination? Dad, I don't make things up that often, do I? Ha 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 ha! Ha 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 ha! Uh, yeah, oh, okay. <laughs> well, they, see, they do seem to be on good terms. And her dad's a decent guy, too. Stern, but decent. Oh, yes, Majima-kun. Koko may have mentioned it already, but what line of work are you in again? My job, huh? Oh man, I think Kokua mentioned that in the backstory she gave me. I'm a dentist. Wow, I wonder which one it was supposed to be. <laughs> Manage a cabaret. I'm a Yakuza. I'm a dentist. Oh yes, yes. That's right, I heard you were a dentist. I never would have guessed from your appearance. Not the face I'd expect from a dentist at all, to be frank. I get told that often, yes. Oh, Dad, you're being so rude to my Goro-chan. Whew. I'm just glad I remember what Koro-chan told me in that hack job of a, ha hack job of a backstory. Uh, incidentally, Majima-kun. Yes? I was wondering, how did you come to meet Kokoa? Oh. Well, that's, uh... I didn't ask you. I asked Majima-kun. Oh, no. Oh, no. She never told us this. But, but... Tell me, Majima-kun, how did you two get to know each other? Oh no! What the? He's prying pretty deep. Is he onto us? Gotta explain how I supposedly met Koko-chan in a way that won't make him more suspicious. She ran into me while eating toast! <laughs> you guys really want me to do three, don't you? God damn it. No, no, no. <laughs> Follow your heart while well, we're doing the movie then. We're doing the movie, then. We happened to sit next to each other at a movie theater. That's how we met. At a movie? Come to think of it, Kokoa did mention that you enjoy movies. Yes. Like I said, Koko-chan just happened to sit next to me. That flick was a real tearjerker. So I offered her my handkerchief, and the rest is history. Yes, that's how it went. Amazing, Goro-chan. I can't believe you came up with such... I mean, remember it like it was 15 minutes ago. It was so romantic. <laughs> Well, what a fortuitous meeting, then. I'm just glad she didn't meet her boyfriend in any places she shouldn't be. Of course not. My Goro-chan is a proper and decent man. There. I've woven Koko-chan's uh, backstory and came up with a tale that rings true enough. Majima-kun, I'm going to put it to you straight. What is it about What is it about my daughter that you find attractive? Oh, no. Oh, no. D Dad, why would you put him on the spot like that? I'm sorry, Kokoa, but I'm just so worried about you. You're still so innocent, like a child. It keeps me awake at night, worrying about whether or not you'll ever manage to live a proper and prosperous family life. If there's a man who would love you and treat you well, why, I would give you my blessing for a marriage right this instant. D Dad, uh... That's why I need to ask, Majima-kun. What about Kokoa do you find attractive? He's looking into my soul here. Oh, I guess I can't blame him. His daughter's future is on the line. I don't like tricking him, but I told Koko-chan I'd go along with this. Gotta find a good reason why I find her so attractive. Well, um, she makes great omelet rice. That, that is one of the things that's part of the backstory. I fell in love with how great the omelet rice she makes is. Oh, I must agree with you there. Her omelet rice has a special quality to it. I love it too. But Majima could. If that's all you see in my daughter, I don't want to give her away to you. If it's delicious omelet, delicious omelet rice that you want, you could just as easily marry a cook. Oh no! Oh no! Dad. Damn it! Tapping into Koko-chan's backstory backfired. From her dad's point of view, he'd want a guy who appreciates his daughter fully, not just for her cooking ability. Oh, would you two excuse me? I need to go wash up. Uh, sure, honey. Don't fall in. Well, awkward! Wait a sec. With her powder in her nose, it's down to just me and her old man. <laughs> Damn. Awkward. <laughs> yes. Majima-kun. 
eat, yes? I have no idea who you really are, but thank you for playing along with my daughter's lie. Oh! Oh! Okay, Dad, let's go! Eh? Her lie? Wait, 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 wait. Oh no! Oh no! Wait. This could be a giga bait where it's basically... Are we gonna get baited by this? Yeah, 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 exactly. This could all be a test, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. What lie? We're all in! I got no idea what you mean. What lie? <laughs> you can stop pretending. I knew this was all an act from the moment I sat down. Was it that obvious? If you knew from the start, what gave us away? Okay, so it didn't matter at all. It literally didn't matter. I could just tell by the way my daughter was acting. I wasn't her father for all those years for nothing. Oh, then why'd you go along with this dumb charade for so long? Hmm. Coco was so desperate to convince me. It's my fault she tried a stunt like this, isn't it? I'm sure it's because I keep pushing her into those dates with all those suitors I'd arranged for her. You know your daughter well. You saw right through her. I lost my wife when Coco was still an infant. Oh my god, they hit me with this music immediately. There's no, like, lead-in or anything. Just immediate... Pain! 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 I lost my wife when Cocoa was still an infant. I raised her alone, without anyone else's help. I tried to raise her well, so no one would look down on her for not having a mother. But I know I've been overly protective of her. I can see now that she's capable of standing on her own two feet. I've got to stop telling my daughter to do this or that. No more pushing her to meet potential suitors. She's her own woman. It's time I learned to let go. Yeah. <laughs> but the truth is, there's another reason I went along with your little charade. Oh, what's that? Someday my daughter's going to bring a real boyfriend to meet me. And I thought this might be good practice. Practice, huh? But thanks to you, I got a good idea of what to expect. When the time comes, I think I'll manage. Oh. Nah. <laughs> Still ain't a good feeling to spend so much time lying to someone who knew it from the start. But I gotta tell you, I think avoiding an arranged marriage wasn't the only reason Coco-chan pulled this stunt. What do you mean? I think she was trying to show you that you don't need to worry about her so much. Worry? Yeah. Pretty plain to see that she's the source of a bundle of your worries. I think she wanted to reassure you that she's capable of looking after herself. She wanted to prove to you that she can manage her own affairs, like getting married. Hmm. That's sweet. Sorry, I'm back. I hope that wasn't too awkward for you guys. Did you even break the silence? Oh, welcome back, Hoka-chan. So listen, your dad actually knew... Majima-kun. Yes? Koko, you've done well finding this man. I had nothing to worry about, after all. Dad. <laughs> I know, right? Goro-chan's a super guy, so this means he'll stop trying to set me up, right? Yeah, of course. Yes. I can see there's no longer any need. Really? Awesome! It's been an awfully long day. I'm heading back to my hotel. Oh, okay. I'll walk you back, Dad. Oh, sweet. Goro-chan, thank you so much for being my boyfriend for even just a few minutes today. Goro-chan, I think you did an excellent job pretending to be my boyfriend. Huh, <laughs> glad to hear it. I wanted to give you this. Thank you. You got five pieces of fluorite. Okay. Whatever the case, I think I'm free from Dad hounding me to meet his suitors. What a relief. That's good. Yes, well, I have to walk my dad to his hotel. Uh. Yep. When you get a real boyfriend, you better do a proper introduction so he doesn't have to worry about you. Hey. I'll try. Bye now. Oh, Cocoa, I forgot something. Give me just a moment. Mm. Oh, okay. Huh? Uh, something wrong? Majima-kun, there's one last thing I need to say. If you would like to marry my daughter, I give you absolute approval. <laughs> yeah. Huh? Eh? 
What's that? Machima kun. I'm glad I got to talk to you. You went through all the bother of pretending to be my daughter's boyfriend just for my sake. You're a good man. But what the what are those eyes? Look at my man here, he's like You're a good man. Eh, I was trying to put one past you. Don't give me too much credit now. No, no, not at all. That's why Oh my god, yes he is! He's about to try and make me into one of the suitors! <laughs> I've got the full read on this quest. I had it clocked from the beginning. I know it. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, of course. I'd like it if you would be my daughter's real boyfriend. <laughs> no, Dad, you, you didn't get it. The whole point of this was that she didn't want you choosing who would be. God damn it. <laughs> Excuse me? What'd you just say? I said, won't you please ask my daughter out for real? Consider it for a moment, but please? What in the fresh hell makes you think that's a good idea? Because you're the ideal man. I told you! I told you! She imagined the ideal man. Goro Majima is the ideal man. That is the way it is. So, I also even called it before he said it. That that is Actually, actually, I use these exact words that he is the ideal man. <laughs> because you're the ideal man. I think I can safely entrust her future to you. Whoa, slow down. I'm having trouble believing my ears. You could start by just pretending. That's fine. Heck, if she won't take you, I will. Wait, what? 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 <laughs> Holy shit. This game is amazing! So progressive! I love it! Uh, did you just say what I think you did? Yeah, Dad, what's this all about? What's all this about? Oh no! Oh no! Uh, give me a break, you two. Yeah, no wonder. Like father, like daughter, like father, like daughter, like father. <laughs> this is why I'm single. <laughs> and there we go. Uh...